Uh, I'm Philip. Uh, I'm from the United States. So I wanted to get my master's degree, but I, I specifically wanted to go abroad because it seemed like a good way to kind of round out the whole experience, um, kind of get a, a new cultural aspect as well as, uh, as my regular studies. It's great. I mean, the, the pandemic situation is what it is, but it's, it's still been a really nice city to be at. I mean, it's, it's February and I was at the beach last weekend, so that's, that's pretty new for me <laughs> coming from Washington. Working as a data scientist, of course, but, but specifically, I think it'd be really cool to work in, in kind of the public policy field. Or there's a lot of opportunity uh, with like philanthropy work, like you hear about the data for good field. Um, so that kind of thing, kind of, kind of working with uh, um, nonprofit organizations and that, that type of field would be really interesting to me. I'd say so, yeah. I mean, I, I think, um, and there's definitely opportunity to get practice in my own time as well. So one thing that I've started doing and I've been talking to professors about a bit as well is just kind of working on my own portfolio. So doing projects on the side, but then also um, getting practice writing as well and, and trying to focus on like data visualization and, and the communication side of it. Um, in addition to the more kind of technically focused skills that we're learning in the classroom. I think, so the, the professors have been really great, um, but then a, a really, I, I think, I, I went to a pretty large school for my undergraduate, um, and what, what's different about this is my, my cohort is, I think are, there are 15 of us in total. Um, so it's been, I, I learn a lot from my professors, but I also am learning a lot from, from my connections with the other students. And I think that's something you wouldn't necessarily get at a bigger school. So it's, it's great being able to kind of personally know the rest of the students in, in, the, in my cohort and uh, kind of know what their backgrounds are, um, what I can learn from them, that kind of thing. So we, we definitely teach each other a lot as well, which has been really positive. Yeah, so it's, it's been uh, really exciting. Again, one of, one of the great things about um, being in a smaller program, uh, and especially in a, in a program abroad, is uh, I'm meeting students, well, I'm meeting people from Spain, of course, but I'm also meeting students from all over the world, from South America, um, students from other parts of Europe, uh, from the Middle East, uh, let's see, there's one of my classmates is from South Korea. So, so really wide distribution of students, and it's, it's been really great kind of getting these different perspectives and actually like I, I learned a lot about history and that kind of thing and like, like current events that I, I wasn't really aware of. So that's been, I think, a very perspective broadening experience. It's been good. It's, it's a lot of information to take in um, and I, I guess, yeah, the, the, there's a lot of information to take in um, and I think the best thing you can do is really just uh, pick what's interesting to you because data science is a massive field. There's tons of different kind of sub-disciplines you could go into if you want. Um, but what's really great here is that I feel like I have kind of the opportunity to learn about these different types of disciplines that I can go to and then also have access to the resources to learn about kind of niches that I really want to focus on and learn about in my own time as well. So, yeah. Positive overall, yeah.